enjoying every bit of Canada, <laughs> every opportunity this country can give me. I think, I think when if I hear about something, I'm bound to jump and uh, take a bite of it. So, <laughs> I am doing my master's uh, in doing research-based um, work at Toronto General Hospital in heart transplant immunology. Uh, I also do a little bit of clinical research where I go see patients as well in the hospital, and it's amazing just to see how my work in the lab can be connected with, uh, you know, to, it's being put towards research that can have an impact in patient care in the long run. For Xerox to sponsor the new Pioneer Awards, in particular in the youth category, is of tremendous importance to us. Welcome to my lab. <laughs> for us, uh, what she has accomplished as a young woman for the short amount of time she's been in this country is just absolutely astounding. What are you doing your research on? What's the primary So focus? I study a molecule called human leukocyte antigen type G, and it's a molecule that was shown to protect the fetus from the mother's immune system during pregnancy. Okay. And so, because it's a naturally found molecule in the body, and it has protective effects from the immune system, um, we asked if we can translate this concept into transplantation, where patients get new organs. Um, so I was born in Kuwait because both my parents uh, immigrated to Kuwait to work there and then we were forced to move back to India, my home country, during the first Gulf War in 1990. And eventually my parents again came back to Kuwait, lived there till 2000. I had just turned 14. Um, entering school was a shock from day one. Uh, noticed people, you know, would find the smallest reason to pick on anyone that's inferior to them in any way. Um, so those observations were very scary. So I kind of was having this double game in my mind, telling myself that, okay, I'm not happy somehow or I'm not comfortable somehow, but I'm forcing myself on the outside to look happy and smiling and trying to adjust. Um, but it was not easy. So this is uh, more of the first summer when the, the, the typical thing of going to Niagara Falls. Oh, if you have to do that, that's a given. <laughs> My mom was living in Kuwait still for the first three years after I came. Okay. But she came back once a year to see us. Oh, that was so nice. So these photos were only taken when she was home. Otherwise, we... That must have been very difficult for it her. Was. It was. Mm -hmm. It's 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 absolutely amazing that someone so young has accomplished so much and I think as an individual, and I think speaking for many people at Xerox, it's certainly very humbling and it's exciting for us to be one of the people to, or to recognize what she's accomplished. Most people come to this country with big dreams and you know, they think this is a land of um, paved with gold and you know, there's plenty of opportunities. But you have to seek after them. Merge the best of both, both worlds. Merge what you have learned from where you came from with what Canada has to offer and you will, your life will be so much more enriching. I'm pleased to announce the recipient of the new Pioneer Youth Award is Jemmy Joseph.